What up, y'all? It's your girl July from Kickback Couture, and I'm here because this baby dropped today, Transit by Baby Audio and Andrew Fong. So a few of you have emailed me and messaged me already asking me how to use this in your beats. So the best way to do it... All right, so I would like to use transit on my melodies, and transit is a transition maker. So it'll take the sound you have and it'll make a transition. So in order to do that, the best way to do it, you'll either want to put it on your master channel or you want to group instruments that you want it to be on. So you could group your drums, you could group your um, instruments, whatever the case might be. For this example, I'm going to take my instruments and group them. All right, so in order to group your channels, you're going to select all of your instruments and you can right click on the mixer channels, go to route to new output bus. Another way to do that is command G on a Mac or control G on a Windows. And I'm just going to call this melody bus. Having deja vu here, I used to talk about melody buses, but whatever. All right, now what we're going to do is drop our plugin in here. It's an effect called transit. Okay. And I'm going to pop it open. I haven't entered my license yet. I will do that. Keep it open. All right. And this is transit. So transit is a transition effect that has about 20 different effects you can utilize in creating transitions and a bunch of presets. All right. Here's the first preset. And this is what it sounds like. All right, so it can essentially make a transition out of your beat. Now, if you want this to be automated, the best way to do it is to take this transit knob here and automate it. And there's another view you can see here that will automatically do it for you. All right, so for example, if I'm coming out of my intro here in this area going into the verse, this is what could happen. Something like that. Now you can also use this knob here to do that. And in order to automate this knob, you want to go to automate up here, um, click on it, and then you'll click on the parameter. We want to automate the transit control knob itself. So once we do that, we'll click here, drag it out, and from zero to 100. And make sure you have the timing right. We want it to be all the way at 100% when we're at the area we're at. <laughs> we want it to be at 100% when we get to the next portion of our beat. And at 0% when it starts. And then it drops back down to zero. So this is what that would sound like. And let's try a different preset here. All right, cool. That is my quick tip today on how to use transit and reason. If you want to grab transit, you can use my link in the description in order to support the channel. It's all culture, kick back, and cook up. If you want to know more about transitions and arranging your tracks, watch this video next.